Good afternoon, everybody. This is Seamus Wishbone reporting live with Weasel News here in 719 here at a skate park in Los Santos. We're here because we have a special event today presented to you by Eleanor and Callie Hall. It's called the 1v1 Me Bro event. It's going to be amazing. A lot of people are going to let off some steam, shoot some of their friends, get revived, of course, and treat everyone safely. Let's hope this all ends safely and everyone has a good time. I'm going to go interview some spectators, hopefully the finalists, and of course the people who created this event. I'll see you soon. Hello, Los Santos. This is Seamus Wishbone reporting live with Weasel News on the scene here with Eleanor and Callie Hall. How are you today? We're doing good. How are you doing today? Good, doing good, right. good. Thank you. Uh, so tell me a little bit more about the event today. What's it called? Uh, it's called the One Me, One Me, Bro. And what are you, uh, what are you offering here? What are people here? Of, uh, what, what's the event? Uh, I saw you, babe. <laughs> so basically, they'll be one v one someone. Uh, tournament style. There's a reward at the end for 100k and a, a weapon skin. 100k and a weapon skin. That's great. A lot of people it seems are excited. I can see them in the background. Then they're all ready to go. What are the What are the rules for this event? So while they're uh, they when it's their turn, they have to stay in that gray circle over there. And of course, you know, only class one weapons, semi-auto pistols. We want no interference from the spectators, you know. It's just sit, watch, and enjoy. Perfect. And is this the first of this event? It is. Yes, sir. Any predictions of what's going to happen? You think things are going to go smoothly here? I well, would hope so. Uh, coming from, uh, you know, me and Callie, we're both officers of the law in this city, and uh, a lot of people like to shoot. So I feel like it, it gives them a chance to, you know, really show who's best at, you know, shooting in the city. And, you know, maybe they can walk away and nobody will f with them, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I feel like this is a good outlet for everyone to get their rage out, you know, get their gun, doing it in a safe manner. We, uh, do you have EMS available, perchance? Um, as of now, we do not. We have our uh, medically trained officers and uh, a couple of, uh... yeah, that's about it. <laughs> yeah, there are people around that will uh, offer aid if needed. Perfect, perfect. So how many, do you know how many contestants you have uh, fighting here today? Yeah, 20. we have about 20, yeah. That's great. Yeah, I'm sure it's going to be an exciting time. Do you have any uh, any predictions, any any winners you see already here? Oh man, I already know. I, I feel like Jesus Hernandez is going to uh, be the winner, but I, I could be wrong. I'm thinking Baby G, maybe. There are a lot of good shooters here. That's great. Baby G signed up. I did not know that. I, I have a uh, yeah. I ha I have high hopes for him as well. So are you, uh, you, I don't know if you mentioned this when I asked the rules, do you guys supply any ammunition, anything, or do they all have to bring their own, uh, weapons? Uh, yeah, they have it's, to bring uh... their own. Okay, is anything off limits? I'm sorry, you mentioned this in the rules, but I want to clarify. Yeah, so it's just, uh, semi-automatic. No, uh, AP pistols or anything that shoots, like, machine guns or anything like that. Perfect, perfect, perfect. One last thing. Is there anything you'd like to say to the people at home watching? Hey, Mom. Look at me. I made it. I'm on TV. Never thought I'd be here. And uh, I really hope for a good outcome tonight. That's great to hear. Well, you heard it here first, folks. We're going to have our first 1v1 me bro, I believe it's called, correct? Correct. Yes, sir. I hope everyone has a good, safe time here. Enjoy the festivities. Get some rage out. You know, I don't know if you guys have seen The Purge. I feel like this reminds me a lot of The Purge. Oh, man. It's a little scary, but yeah. Yeah, it's a little scary, but it's legal. It's safe. I hope everyone enjoys their time. This is Seamus Wishbone signing out. Here we are. The event is about to begin. Eleanor's about to go over the rules. It looks like everyone's excited. Let's listen in and make sure we uh, get all the rules here to make sure no one is doing any funny business. All right, guys. Are you ready? Can you guys all hear me? All right, we're gonna. Loud and clear. All right, so, um, the rules are going to be, you, you have to stay in the perimeter, like of the gray, 
for sure. Sidewalk. It looks like a circle kind of behind the ramp. Uh, you have to stay in that. No going on the grass. <laughs> no going, you know, to the crowd or anything like that. Um, it's bring your own pistol, bring your own ammo. Uh, Kelly, can you clear it up? Yeah, so semi-auto pistols are allowed in the attachments. And if you're in the crowd spectating, please don't, you know, try to help out your buddy if he's 1v1 or anything stupid like that. I'm not okay. Any questions on what you can and can't do? Uh, and yes, you can roll. Is healing a lot? Here we see one of the contestants, the first contestants actually, getting ready. They have their pistol out. They got their J's ready. Let's see what happens, everybody. Need to stay on the concrete. Get out of the grass. You see those rolling moves? This reporter couldn't even imagine what it'd be like to roll and shoot like that. Take some real skill. As you can see, they're rushing in, trying to get enough oh, cover. Oh shit! We were really close to being shot there. This guy's wearing all white. Not good for the blood that's about to be spilled all over this floor. And we have a clear winner here. A little bit of overkill, but we have a winner. Here we have another participant getting ready. Good luck to both of these gentlemen. This guy? Oh no. We have an officer from LSPD participating in this event. It just shows you how dedicated these people are to having fun with the community. You can't, you can't rob me. Huh? Is this allowed? Oh, it's over. And they're meeting. Here we go. Oh, with the oh, headshots. With the headshots. Officer down. Officer down. As always, let's go with Medic and the crowd over there. Taunt the officer. You did a good job, officer. Don't worry about it. Here we got fellow FAP mechanic CJ. With a quick victory. Congratulations, CJ. As you can see, folks, it's now nighttime. I'm not sure if that makes it better or worse for these shooters. Ooh, it's better man. because they can take cover in nightfall, but if they can't see that well. He's, at yeah, least this reporter can't. Sure. I'm sure you guys will be able to see yeah. post-production yeah, right. here. Both of them, not sure. They're both hurt. Oh, both of them die. I'm sure a lot of things are going through their minds. How much ammo do I have left? How much is my opponent? We'll see what happens. Yeah, no, nah, first I almost I almost had you. Moment I shot you would have been dead. And there we go, we have a winner. We have a winner. Oh, yeah, because I was pushing. Hello, I'm uh, Barney Biggums here with Weasel News, uh, reporting live coverage from the uh, 1v1 Me Pro event in uh, 719 in the park. Uh, you know, they've been uh, they've been shooting at each other in the right there over the half pipe. Luckily, EMS is here to, uh, you know, revive the loser. But, uh, you know, there is no reviving that uh, that shame. Uh, <laughs> what are your thoughts, uh, James, right? Yeah. Yes, James. Yeah, yeah, James. So, uh, when when you when you uh, show up? Did you show up right at the beginning of the event or what? Um, I'm actually just not showing up, but uh, some 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 guys helped me sign up for it because I didn't have the cash. So. Oh no way! You're gonna be participating? Yeah, yeah, I'll be participating at some point. Damn, you are you like ex-military or something? You got some experience with a you know, with, with a firearm? Uh, I did a lot of virtual training. I'm told it's uh, similar to to real life. I, I guess we'll find out. <laughs> oh, we're gonna find out today. Yeah, I guess. So. Yeah, are you ready to uh, to take the take the pain? What were, were these paintballs or something? I guess they're paintballs, you know. But uh, it, it is it is what it ammo, is. I don't know. Right, right. <laughs> so um, yeah, good luck to you on your uh, on your match. Um, so um, do you know who you're gonna be facing, or is it just like out of the pool? It's out of the pool. I, plus, I don't want to know. I don't care. Yeah, no, I'll get dropped down all the same. Ooh, confident man, James. <laughs> all right. Well, uh, this is uh, Barney Biggums, and uh, I'll see you over there at the, sh at the shooting gallery over there, James. Good luck to you. Absolutely. Thank you. you guys have a great day.
Here we are starting the second rounds of the one me one me bro event. We have, I believe, Baby G as they call him. Let's see who wins this one, you guys. There's a lot of a uh, lot of duck and covers here. A lot of shots being taken here. Let's we'll see what happens. Looks like Baby G has won. Mr. Mike Big has fallen. Nice. You can feel Every, the anticipation everybody. grow in the crowd hey. as we get closer to that final Stop round. Who will be it. the winner? Yeah, Hopefully we can get an interview with the winner. And the cash prize of $100,000 and a free weapon skin is at the line here. Hey, this is Barney Biggums back at you again with uh, more coverage from the uh, 1v1Me situation event here in Los Santos on this beautiful sunny day. Here we got Mocha and Wanda, uh, a couple spectators. What are your thoughts so far? Who do you think is going to win? Who do you think is going to take the final $100,000 cash pot? I feel, I feel like this is going to win. It's the only one person I know. Oh, he's he a good my shooter? Too, to be honest. Sweet, sweet. So you you already got your money down. I wonder if there was any betting uh, being done here, maybe behind the scenes. If there was, I wish I'd known, because I would be in on it. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> so, um, do either of you lovely ladies have any experience uh, shooting, by chance? Yes, sir. Oh, no. <laughs> At Maybe. the range, though. At the shooting yeah, range. Yeah, yeah, of yeah. Course. yeah. Of course. Anywhere else. Yeah. It's for our uh, license. Only legal shooting, you know? Absolutely. Um, me personally, uh, absolutely none. Uh, yeah. Uh, definitely something to get under my belt at, at some point. But um, yeah, it's been really exciting so far, the event. And uh, are either of you participating? No, we're just observating. Ah, okay, maybe maybe next week, you know, <laughs> definitely for sure. Are you looking Is... to try out too next week? Maybe. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just... <laughs> muscle spasm. Muscle uh, spasm. This is fine. I'm this, this, this seems... She has muscle spasms. I I promise it's not a violent. You know. This, like... seem, this seems to happen a lot. This seems to happen a lot, but it's okay. Yeah, it's just it's a reflex. Whenever I speak, she just <laughs> honestly this is the best. <laughs> she knows what she talks. Uh, but but anyway, yeah. So it, there's a lot of people out here today having a lot of fun, yes. and uh, we're gonna get back to the events and uh, see how things go. Back oh. to you, Seamus. The officer of the law has stripped and is ready to take this W. Let's see how well LSPD's finest is trained. We got a Mexican standoff here. And oh. down goes LSPD. RIP for the boys. Shave my head. Shave my head, Seamus. As you can see, Barnabas Bigums here has taken a shot to his knee. We have a wheelchair. Oh, we're missing the action. And we have... Ooh, lots of rolling. Lots of rolling. Oh, I can't smoke while in the chair. Wait, <laughs> hey, hey, hop is. in, hop in. I want to see if I can get on a bike with you. <laughs> oh, that was a nice roll out of that. Yeah. This competition is getting close here, everybody. Hang tight. Oh my god. Good shit. Good shit, Ray. <laughs> and Ray 
is All right, the winner. everybody congratulate Ray. Congratulations to Ray. Let's see if we can get an interview here. Huh? How you get dropped like that? Well, here we are with the winner of the 1v1 Me Bro event. Here, Ray is the winner of a $100,000 prize as well as a free weapon skin. Ray, how do you feel? Uh, I feel pretty good. Uh, everyone had good fights. It was a good round. Uh, you know, it was a fun event. That's great. That's some awesome shooting you did there. Do you have any experience or is this just luck? Uh, a little bit of both. Uh, this is my first city, so I've been here three weeks, probably less than three weeks, but you know, I think it's anybody's game as long as you hit the headshot. Great, great, great. So what are you, any plans for the money? What are you going to do? You're going to invest? You're going to spend it on a nice car? What are you going to do? I was thinking about buying a car and painting it white or something. That would be great, yes. So that once again, here we are at 719 at the skate park with the winner of the 1v1 Me Bro event, Jay. Is there anything else you'd like to say to all the fans watching at home? Uh, don't sleep on me. That's all I'm going to say. You heard it here first, folks. I heard a lot of trash talking going on, so. <laughs> there you, know, you go. You, you know who you are. You know who you are. There you go, everybody. Being called out by Ray, who has the rights winning this event thank you everybody this is Seamus Wishbone signing out well here we are at the end of the 1v1 meme bro event Ray is the winner we're here with Eleanor and Callie who are again hosting this event how do you guys think it went I amazing. think yeah I think it went amazing a better turnout than I uh, could ever imagined for our first time ever hosting an event I think it went really really well I'd agree. Everyone seemed to have a good time. There were no real fights. Everyone kept a very professional, very safe. Any plans for a future event like this one? Absolutely. Um, I, I was talking to the crowd during the 1v1s, and uh, I think they'd like to have it either every two weeks or once a month. And I think uh, I think Kelly and I can uh, come up with that. That is great. Any, any ideas for uh, how to keep things fresh, how to keep things different for future events? We'll have to, you know, go through what we did here today and try to come up with more stuff. So, you know, it's enjoyable every time. That is great. Well, I'm sure I can speak for everyone. We all had a good time. I had a good time watching, good time spectating. Everything was safe. Once again, this was the one me, one v one me bro event here at 719 at the skate park, hosted by our uh, Cali and Eleanor Hall. And there you have it, folks. The end of the one v one me bro event. It was an amazing time. We were all safe. Good sportsmanship out of here. Good safety laws. Everyone had a good time relieving some stress. We of course got an interview with the winner as well as the people hosting this event. Hopefully, we'll get a new one very soon. Once again, this is Seamus Wishbone uh, with Barnabas Biggums again reporting live from Weasel News. Have a good night, everybody. I hope everyone stays safe out there.